Hi, I'm Doug Keating, and this is All The Way Leadership, a company designed with one purpose in mind, and that is to help make you a better leader. Last time, I talked about the fact that strong leaders craft a winning strategy. The next series of blogs and videos is going to go deeper into the topic of strategy. Why am I wearing a baseball shirt? It's opening day. Let's play ball. As a leader, it's important you understand what a strategy actually is. Some leaders struggle with thinking strategically because they don't know what it really means. If you're like me, you hear the word strategy thrown around a lot. I would offer that many people are talking about tactics, processes, and procedures when they use the word strategy. What I'm going to share is a tool of the trade as far as how to define a strategy. A simple diagram that you can use to draw out your strategy. Let's talk about what a strategy actually is. This diagram is the easiest way I know to describe a strategy. On the left is the current state. We are here, that is your team and you, on the blue circle where the red star is. On the right is the green circle, the future state. That is where you want to be. The strategy is going to describe how you're going to go from here to there. Any strategy that does not include a how is not actually a strategy. I'm going to say that again because I've sat in countless strategic briefings that never included a how and the team walked away clueless about what the strategy actually was. Any strategy that does not include a how is not actually a strategy. I'm going to talk through an example of a strategy with no how in it. Years ago, I worked for an organization that really didn't understand strategy. The business unit I worked in didn't know how to articulate strategic thinking. One year, all we received from leadership was the strategy of grow the business. The current state was articulated simply with a revenue number we generated the last year, $100 million. The future state was another number, our target for the next year. 120 million. The strategy was we need to grow by 20 million or 20 percent. No mention at all about how we would do it. Go and grow. Wow! Talk about a strategy with no how in it. What happened next was completely predictable. The leadership team struggled to get everyone motivated. The go and grow strategy was not well received by the leadership team. Marketing conditions were changing and the next year was going to be way harder than the last year. The growth target was much larger than the previous one, twice as large. Leaders in the business unit wondered how in the world are we going to grow twice as fast in a tough market? No clear answers were provided by the senior leaders. The reality is they didn't know how to do it. They were simply hoping for the best. The leadership team struggled to get everyone bought into the strategy and motivated to make it happen. As a result, yeah, we didn't have a good year. We missed the target and new leaders were brought in to fix the problem. What about you? Do you know how to craft a winning strategy? Have you taken the time to formulate, codify, and communicate it to your team and stakeholders? If not, make the investment now. I cannot put stomp enough the important strategy is going to play in a post-pandemic world. If so, you're going to enjoy the next few blogs. We're going to explore this topic in detail to include points to ponder, practical, tactical tips, and lesson learned based on decades of experience. I'm Doug Keating, and this has been All The Way Leadership, a company designed with one purpose in mind, and that's to help make you a better leader. The world is in desperate need of women and men who lead with confidence, clarity, and creativity. It's time to become the leader your world needs. Let's go all the way.